Hi, my name is Maria, and thanks for visiting this YouTube channel. Today, I will be teaching you how to count in Japanese from 1 to 10 and more. So I would say counting Japanese in Japanese are probably the easiest one that I've been teaching you so far. And it probably won't get that difficult after 10 either. So here's a number from 1 to 10, and this is how you read it. One is ichi. Two is ni. Three is san. Four is shi. Five is go. Six is roku. Seven is shichi. Eight is hachi. Nine is q. Ten is ju. So I'm going to count from one to ten all together. Ich, ni, san, shi, go, rok, shich, hach, kyu, ju. So when I start learning English, it was kind of hard for me to learn after 10 because it was kind of different. But in Japanese, it's exactly the same because you literally read the number from left to right. And for example, 11 is ju ichi and ju means 10 and ichi means 1, so it's 10-1. And 12 is ju ni, and that also means 10 and 2. And it goes on like ju san, ju shi, ju go, ju roku, ju shichi, ju hachi, ju kyu, ni ju. So here's a practice for you. So try to read this number. Okay, so it's 15, and if you want to say in Japanese, it's 10, 5, so it will be 15. Now try this one. Okay, so this one is 28, and it's 20 and 8, so it's 20. Now, let's use these numbers in sentences. The first sentence, it says, Anata wa nansai desu ka? And that means, how old are you? And you would answer, Watashi wa? And you would put your age, and I'll just say, I'm 16. So, you would say, Juroku sai And sai means ears. So, okay, yeah. It means I am 16 years old. Here's the second question. Kore wa ikura desu ka? And it means how much is this? And you can answer by saying Kore wa Rokuju nien desu. Because it's 60 and 2, so it's roku ju ni and this. And it just means this is 62 yen. Okay, so the last question, I made it more visual. Um, so this one says, Maru wa ikutsu arimasu ka? And it means how many circles are circles are there. So you can just count and try to answer this question. Okay, so I'm gonna say in Japanese Maru wa Jusanko Arimas. So I said Ju San. Can you guess what it means? Okay, it means there are 13 circles in here. 
Thank you for watching my video and this is the fourth one. Um, next time I'll be teaching you the Japanese currency. So I hope you'll watch it too. Okay, bye. Sayonara.